the Portal Court High Court has extended an in interim order restraining the Chief Judge and Clerk of the River State House of Assembly from interacting with the Speaker Mattis Ame with the Lead House of Assembly. This development comes after Governor Sim Fubara and the Attorney General of River State secured the initial order in a suit filed against Ami Wille and 26 other lawmakers. The suit aimed at stopping potential impeachment plans by the Ami Wille led House of Assembly. List lawmakers led by Victor Ukojumbu, the Chief Judge, the Clerk of River State House of Assembly, and the People's Democratic Party, PDP, as second defendant. On July 8th, Justice Jumbo Stephens ordered the parties to maintain the status quo pending the determination of the motion on notice. The court specifically instructed that an order of interim injunction is hereby made restraining the 31 and 32nd defendants from dealing or howsoever relating with the first to 27th defendants as members of the River State House of Assembly and from receiving, forwarding, or however acting on an, on any resolutions, articles of impeachment, or other dependent pending the hearing and determination of the motion on notice for interlocutory injunction already filed herein, that the parties to the to this suit are hereby directed to maintain the status quo anti litem in this suit of fifth as of 5th of July 2024, pending the hearing and interdenominational a uh, determination of the motion on notice for interlocutory mm. locutory filed hearing. And other is hereby made for substitute service or the originating and the other processes in the suit on the first to 30th city defendants by pasting the same at quarters opposite former NDDC headquarters of Aba Road, Porter Court, River States. <laughs> this uh, wiki and its men, they don't want to relent at all. They no one relents. <laughs> they are just running from pillar to post, from one place to another, because of what? Not because of the people. They have never come out to tell you that, uh, oh, we, this is what we want the government to do or the governor to do for the people. Oh, people are complaining about this. We just want to amend this law. But no, all about, it's all about removing uh, Fubara. So are these the kind of people you think you can trust? No, they cannot be trusted. They can never, never, never be trusted. And they are not for the masses. If you believe them, like I always say, believe them at your own peril. Because these guys, they are something else. Yes. Meanwhile, on July 8th, the Justice Jumbo ordered the, the parties to maintain the status quo pending the determination of the motion on notice. So why are they running up and down? Who is running? Is it for Barra's men or the weakest men that are running up and down? Because I know the people who are at loss now are Wiki and his men. They are the ones at loss. Because to a very large extent, the governor is still there and is loved by many. And people have seen through that what a wiki is doing is not just because of the people. You have done your own part. Leave the man alone. The state is not your own. It's not your money. You say you spent money, this and that. Is it your money? Who were you? I remember one time when they were, somebody was saying that a wiki did not even have to one million naira in his account before he joined politics. So where did he get the money? Which business was he doing? Some people will tell you that they say Naigbe Motu Park man I be because even the his own his antecedents when you look at him, he doesn't even look it. Everywhere is where he is is wahala 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 wahala. It's all the bus wahala everywhere. And you expect uh, people to be to be clapping for you because Nigeria is not a lawless place. People support uh, anything, anything at all irrespective of anything it's just to support it even at their own detriment they don't care how can you be supporting people if you are supporting all these uh, sports everything if they don't have any 
direct or indirect impact in you you can support them and move on but these people that you are supporting they are making life unbearable they don't even like you in return so i don't even understand why supporting somebody or defending somebody who does not even care about you is that not a unreasonable thing to do is that not foolishness hmm? is it not yes it is so 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 dangerous running from pillar to post just because of what not because you are representing the people that you claim you are representing i mean why they are sweet aim at stopping potential uh, impeachment plans by the i mean will lead us of assembly yes list lawmakers uh, led by jumbo oku jumbo well the the right thing must be done at the right time and if the right thing is not done then the consequences of that you know we live with the people watch this video to the end 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 So guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you. Big Tube TV.